All right, I'm going to be drawing something that's kind of like a nightmare. Kind of like a nightmare. Like if this existed for real, it would be, it'd be kind of scary. Cause in today's episode, we're going to be drawing a mad mosquito. Ugh. I don't particularly, listen, I am all for all kinds of creatures on our actually really nice planet that we have. It's very nice, I love it. Um, Mars does not look as appealing, sorry Elon. Uh, sorry not sorry though, sorry not sorry. I like plan A of just like chilling on Earth, but like also space travel is kind of necessary. Anyway, so distracted, but we are in fact going to be creating a mad mosquito. Sorry, I got there eventually. You see, it takes me a while. Sometimes I get distracted, you know. So, so distracted. Okay, in this lovely art making episode of awesome epic creativity, our two words today, remember we take two words, we switch them together. Our two words today are uh, mad and mosquito. And today's epic artistic adventure we're going to be creating mad mosquitoes. Yeah, ew, right? <clears throat> okay, <laughs> so grab something to draw with and something to color with and let's make some <laughs> This episode is brought to you by artastickids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at artastickids.com. All right, we're doing a mad mosquito, mad mosquito. All right, mad mosquito, guys, here we roll. Mad mosquito, okay, let's do this. Okay, one. Big circle and one slightly smaller circle right just slightly above the first one for the eyes. In each circle we're going to draw a curving line. And then you can go ahead and color in the dark of the eyes leaving those little curving triangles. Nice and white for the glare of light and the shiny spot on those eyes. All right, between the eyes, we're gonna draw a nice curving line. Sorry, letter U or a curving line, and then we're gonna bring it down and around and exaggerate it a bit. And then go back up and connect. Okay. Above the eyes, we're gonna do sort of like a crazy check mark here, a curving check mark to make them angry. Right? It's mad. I'm gonna give it to me. Angry expression. Oh, geez, I hit the turn that into something, Kathleen. Oh my goodness, Ms. Artastic, what's happening, yo? Okay, I got a little too intense. That's what happens when you're so mad. Sometimes you accidentally make bad choices. Okay, all right, mosquito needs well, it needs a head, so I'm gonna draw a circle around there. Then I'm gonna draw a body, so I'm gonna draw a nice curving line here. I'm gonna draw a big, another big curve here. This is gonna be the red part. It's gonna be full of blood because it's a mosquito. Yuck. Okay, let's add two little wings. So weird, right? Ew. We'll add some diagonal lines in there for some texture. Ew, it's so creepy, right? Gross. Okay, let's add some antennae. We'll also make them really creepy and small. Ew, uh, it's already freaking me out. I hate mosquitoes. Okay, we'll add some creepy little legs. Just add some little stickies down here. Make them thick. Ew, I hate, I do not like, I dis, I strongly dislike mosquitoes. There we go, we got some legs. Three on each side. Three, and these are smaller because they're on the other side of the body. Okay, this is like super shiny. We should make this shiny because it's like full of blood. But so angry! 
It's an angry mosquito. I mean, no, it's not. It's not angry mosquito. It's a mad mosquito. Mad mosquito. Yeah, I went there. Okay, go ahead and color in your mad mosquito. Whatever color you want. I want to make this like a fleshy color. Ew, and I'm even more grossed out. You guys, isn't it yucky? But like, it's also nature, so like not yucky, but also yucky. Yeah, I know, it doesn't make sense, right? Life doesn't make sense sometimes. Just gotta go with it. Even when it comes to mosquitoes. The worst part of mosquitoes is when you are walking and you're like minding your own business and then all of a sudden, there's like a swarm around you and you have to like run through the swarm of mosquitoes so you don't get mosquitoized from the mad mosquitoes. Mosquitoized isn't a word, but what I mean is like when they all are like flying and you hear them buzzing in your ear. Ugh. Gross. Makes me feel yucky just thinking about it. Cause mosquitoes are mad. Okay. Mad mosquito. Never gonna get that out of my head. I have a little blue highlighting here. The wonders of crayons. Ooh, I'm gonna shade this with blue, with a blue, blue, blue. Blue shadows. Yeah. Gray, do I have any gray? Oh, through that. Whoa, whoa. Oh yeah, a little bit of gray left. Makes me sad when my grays are gone. I use them quite a bit. I'm gonna have to use black wax crayon. See, this is the thing is if you don't have your gray and you're like, oh, I don't have a gray. No worries. Just grab a gray, I mean a black pencil crayon or colored pencil, whatever you call it. And also grab, or grab a black wax crayon and just color lightly and that's gonna make some gray shading. So cool. It's just, it's just, it's just, okay. You're like, why Miserastic is the rest not done? Don't worry, I'm getting there. I'm gonna paint the rest on my Mad mosquito. Oh, gross. Uh, it's like a little trail here. Ew. I don't like it. I feel like I'm currently illustrating my nightmares. These are things that keep me up at night. All right, and um, oh no, my antennae. Mm, let me mix this. And once you're done, your mad mosquito is done.